Irish negative people, how are you guys doing? Everything good? Um, this is Mike the Man from RacistNegative.net and I've been doing this for quite a few years and um, I am of course probably for the rest of my life going to research the origin of Irish negative blood as far back as we can possibly go and it's difficult because there is not a lot of interest. There is not a lot of interest out there from um, uh, these messages all coming in at once. I'm not going to start this video again. I'm tired of that. So, arch negative people basic. Oh, Jesus, man. See, that's I'm I'm a negative, and the, the problem with people who are a negative is to get sidetracked super easily you know when i talk about the personalities and blood types i always 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 stretch that i will say things to you that may uh you may not like to read or may not like to hear because i am looking at every single blood type what are the advantages and what are the disadvantages when you look at the personality predispositions you know, I always said that all negative people are natural born leaders, very intuitive, but when things go wrong, they can go nuts and co can go crazy. And, uh, you know, I've seen plenty of studies and I've shared some of them where you can see actually the mental health, uh, when you have mental he different mental health issue, issues, uh, you see the people who have them and you look at what the blood type frequencies are and there are certain types of uh, mental health issues that are uh, showing significant numbers of people with certain blood types and um, you know anybody who dismisses the blood types and personality traits go hand in hand of course should continue watching CNN you know what I mean just uh, let them tell you what to think and the world would be all right you know what i mean your input not needed um of course there is a proven correlation between blood types and health differences physical ones mental ones and you know mental mental and personality of course go hand in hand the predispositions so you have to be like out in the clouds to even uh make any kind you know we, we know that so the the personality traits you know of the old negatives i have of course just now discussed a little bit you know i've written a lot more about that of course if you're into it read it uh a negative people are good communicators usually you know i'm a negative i'm not going to talk about myself right now you know it's 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 pretty uh you know inappropriate to uh highlight the good about me you know so probably good communicators very uh observant very um very sensitive which can also be a downfall you know the good always has a bad to it and uh, of course the bad is that you get sidetracked easily that you can have a plan and you sort of get um you know the flow that's around you sort of leads you into a different direction that you allow that to happen you know that is the negative about the a negative and with the b people they're super stern they're very focused they set a goal they go for it now however that also means that they often miss warning signs along the way they don't pick up on them and people who are a b negative well uh first of all they don't have the o recessively and the o is what keeps you grounded and intuitive so ab people often are drawn to people who are o ab people are good listeners good learners good observers but often do not know what to do when they have to make a decision this is mike the man from this is negative.net and i talk to you guys the next time